Hi, Bill Bennett again. This video is about our 16C collar closer. The 16C collar closer takes a shorter draw tube than the previous draw tube for the S20 and S26, which is this longer one right here. The uh, 16C has an adapter that the collar screws into, and it also has a brass ring that is a guide as it goes into the rotary table hole. So now we're going to mount the collar closer to the rotary table and show how the collar chuck is mounted. Okay, we have the collar closer mounted to the rotary table. The first step is to mount the adapter for the 16C collar chuck. The adapter has a flange on the back that locates inside the bore of the rotary table. Gets it pretty well centered. The collar adapter has the anti-rotation screw that uh, comes already mounted. Uh, the screw looks like this. It has a uh, anti-rotation screw that go into the collar like that and keep it from turning. Uh, then there's also a locking nut, a locking screw that goes against the anti-rotation screw. And when you take your collet and line it up with the uh, screw, it'll slide in and out and it won't turn. So we're using the rounded nose T-nuts in the three slots that are short. And you can see this demonstrated in the previous video. I'm just going to put uh, one of these in now to hold in place for the sake of the video. Then we have the collet chuck. The collet chuck has four adjustment screws, so it can, it can be adjusted for center with an indicator in the uh, bore of the uh, collet chuck. So you have four of these that come in with the order. Uh, I'm just going to put one of these screws in also. said in the previous part of the video, the uh, adapter is already mounted on the draw tube. Okay, so now that we have the collet chuck and adapter mounted, we're going to take the collet and we're going to put it into the chuck. We're going to rotate it to find the anti rotation screw and push it in until it touches the uh, draw tube. Then what you do is take your collar the adjusting wrench that came with your collar closer and holding the collar, holding against the collar against the draw tube, rotate the draw tube until the collar hits the end of the threads and lock it there. Okay, I've got the air hooked up and we're going to trigger the collar closer. That's it for this video.
once the collet's installed completely, you take your collet adjustment nut and you want to screw it against your washer and adjust your collet by triggering your collet closer in and out and keep screwing your collet adjustment nut in until you have the minimum uh, travel for your collet to open and close.